Old mystery solved after DNA evidence linked an Iowa woman to their hero. That hero, a man who gave his life trying to save people who drove off a Sacramento bridge. And today, that hero's daughter came to the Sacramento area to finally bring the remains of her dad home. CBS 13's Kelly Ryan is live at the Yolo County Coroner's Office. She talked to her today. Kelly? Well, earlier today, we had a chance to show Christine Feldhaus the Tower Bridge. It's a place she's never been before, and it's a place where her father was last seen alive. Christine Feldhaus's search for her father ended here on the Tower Bridge. She describes it as beautiful, but coming here as emotional. She spent the last year trying to find her father, who left Iowa when she was just three years old. She always wondered where he could be. A few weeks ago, she found those answers. The Yolo County Coroner's Office recently identified the remains of a 1987 John Doe as James Ray Miller of Iowa. The previously unidentified man had jumped into the Sacramento River in an attempt to rescue people who drove off the bridge. An intoxicated bridge operator raised the span without turning on the warning lights. Two people in the truck drowned. According to the Yolo County Sheriff's Office, a few days later, another body was recovered, a John Doe. But after a birth certificate mix-up and an alleged con man who took the ashes, identifying John Doe was complicated. Last year, she began searching missing persons and came up with a photo she thought resembled her dad. She submitted DNA and it was a match. With the help from the Yolo County Coroner's Office, she was able to claim her father's ashes today in a box with a plaque describing him as a hero. And it's just, it's a good feeling. I'm really happy that, that they think that way of him. He really left a good impression and that's the dad that I will wish everybody could have seen. And coming up tonight, more on Christine's journey here and also why she wanted to fly from Iowa to Sacramento and pick up her father's ashes in person. Kelly Ryan live in Yolo County for us. Kelly, thank you.